one and all, I'm Alexis aka The Soft Reader and I'm here today to do the bookish scavenger hunt, the Halloween edition. Um, I needed a video for today and I literally just got done watching uh, Haley over at Haley and Bookland do the bookish scavenger hunt video uh, and I literally was like I want to do that so bad but in the month of October um, I'm only doing like Halloween themed videos so I was like how can I get it to, to work? Um, so basically I just googled Halloween scavenger hunt, Just I kind of looked at different ones and then took items off of those and made them into bookishy type questions. Uh, so that's basically what I did. Um, and so yeah, so I've got 10 of them here and I'll go ahead and just look for some books. The first one is Jack-o-lantern and it's to find an orange book. Um. Uh, hmm. And for that one, I'm going to go with Incantation by Alice Hoffman. Uh, as you guys can see, this is totally orange on the cover, and it's, um also orange technically under the dress jacket as well. The next question is black cat and it is to find a book with an animal in it, like where an animal is a character or something like that. And for that I'm going to go with The Titan's Curse by Rick Forward and this is the third book in the Percy Jackson series and there is a Pegasus in here who is named Blackjack. So. It works. The next question is ghosts, and it's to pick a book that features ghosts in it. And I'm gonna go with the Mediator series by Meg Cabot. This is basically about a girl who speaks to ghosts, so there are a lot of ghosts in this series. The next one is Gravestone, and that is to choose a thriller. And I'm gonna choose a book I'm currently reading, and that is You by Caroline Kepnes. The next question is Mask, and that is to pick a book that is about superheroes. And for this one, I'm gonna have to go with a book I haven't read yet, and that is Hero by Perry Moore, which is actually about a young man who is a superhero. I think he's from a superhero family, and he's also gay. So there's this one. The next one is Frankenstein and it's to choose a book with an anti-hero. And for this one I'm going to go with Vicious by V.E. Schwab because the main character Victor very much falls under the anti-hero category. The next one is Vampire and that is to choose an underrated vampire book. So no, you can't just pick Twilight and or Vampire Academy. Give me something underrated. And for this one I'm going to go with Strange Angels by Lily St. Crow. Um, this is like a very interesting take on vampires where they're not like wholly like vampires. Um, but yeah, this is a really interesting take on the myth and uh, I really like this series. The next question is Eyeball and that is to choose a book that has a face on the cover. And for that one I'm gonna go with Delirium by Lauren Oliver, though honestly looking at my Lauren Oliver books I feel like most of them, most of her books fit into this category. Um, but yeah, I went ahead with Delirium and look. There's an eyeball on there. And the last one is Witch, and that is to choose a book that features magic. Hmm, I don't know what I want to do for this one. And for that one, I'm going to go with Shadow and Bone by Lee Bardugo. In this world, there are these people who are called Grisha, who basically have like a variety of different abilities, but it's all very magical, um, and the setting of this world is really magical as well. So it's perfect for when you've got a hunger for a book with magic. Alrighty guys, so that was the Halloween edition book scavenger hunt. Um, I'd really like to do the original one too, I probably won't do it for a couple of months just because I just obviously am doing this one. Um, but yeah, uh, if you guys would like to do this too, it's not too late, Halloween is still a couple of days away, um, and I would love if you guys did it, or if you want to make up your own version you can. I would really love to know either a recommendation for a book about superheroes or your favorite underrated vampire book. I would love to know the answer to that one and I'll see you guys soon with another video.